Can you grab the hotter sixer sauce real quick? Yes, sir. Oh. I got caught in the lights, bro. Time to get Monday drunk. That's freaking good. Ooh, Corey, what do we got today on the beer train? Today we got two brothers, Artisan Brewing Premium Lager. Follow your passion, drink ours. Oh wow, my passion is alcoholism. <laughs> well, you share something in common with the two brothers. Maybe they need to add a third. Did we just become best friends? Yep. Uh, very good. 4.8% um, alcohol. There we go. 14 IBUs mm -hmm. and 12 fluid ounces. <laughs> well, that's delicious. That'll really hit the spot today. And then. We got three different hot sauces here yeah. today. Uh, Mr. Joel Embiid is in this lineup, which is kind of crazy. And this we'll is a famous that. one. That's this, what I hear. This Tell is me about like this. a three. This is selling aftermarket for like three hundred bucks. I didn't know that until we opened it, and someone was on the YouTube's. Yeah. Was on the commenting, and they typed in there, and they said, "Hey, you guys can sell that on eBay's." <laughs> and I was like, "Whoa, why?" And then I looked it up, and it was three hundred dollars. I said, "Whoa." Yeah, Mountain Dew sent us this one of the reps, and I said to Corey, "I was like, dude, should we sell it?" And you were great. You said, "No, we should do the video." So in that situation, you were like the shoulder with the angel, and I was the devil. Yep. You know so. they say, "Bros before hoes." Mm -hmm. I say views before money. <laughs> Doesn't rhyme, but it's effective. Mm -hmm. Ah, fine, you win. Very excited. I am uh, seeing spots from how hungry I am here on this Monday. Uh, I've had alcohol now before I've had food, which is a fun thing to say out loud. What's our first hot sauce? First up, we've got Charman Brand. This is their Sriracha hot sauce. It's got one of the ugliest roosters you could ever imagine on the label. And um, it's gonna give me nightmares. I can't wait to eat it though. I've never seen a sexy rooster. Oh, bro, I've seen some gobblers that get me going. <laughs> some gobblers. Now, who's responsible? I say, who's responsible for this unwarranted attack on my person? Uh, this is bright, bright red. Uh, if you're a fan of colors. Yeah, dude. Or just descriptions <laughs> of colors. You don't have to be a fan of the color. Look at this thing. That is bright freaking red, dude. Uh, and as always, wing stop wings to, to suck down the sauce. So, here we go, Charman. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. I like the flavor. Good flavor. A little bit of heat coming. Not too bad. Mm -mm. That's but, sriracha based. I think I like regular sriracha personally better, but that's tasty. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is very good. Good flavor, decent heat. Not too hot, not too bland. Good consistency. You can see the flex in it. Yep. F-L-E-C-K-S, not F-L-E-S. Not, mm -hmm. not flex. All right. That was a crime scene. All right, what do we got next? Next up is another bright boy. This is the Joel Embiid's Hot Habanero. It's their collaboration uh, between Mountain Dew and Joel Embiid. It's a citrus and habanero, and habanero flavored mashup. Mm -hmm. Hot, this is something no one's ever asked for. <laughs> Hot sauce with the flavor of dew. And Who's drinking Mountain Dew and playing Halo and goes, man, I really wish my wings tasted like this Mountain Dew. No one said that, you're right. Yeah, right? right? That's absolutely This insane. is the weirdest Venn diagram of like, yeah, you know, things people like. Like, I'm a big fan of Joel Embiid, mm -hmm. Mountain Dew, and hot sauce. Wow. Do the do. Gross. Look. <laughs> yeah. I would say this is probably the complete inverse of Sixer Sauce. Huge brand, huge celebrity, a lot of money went into it, and we're just like, we're out here grinding, dude. You know, we'll be there. We will be in the paint with Joe Embiid one day. Uh -huh. Business wise, not basketball. I mean, look, I have the shirt on that says Pizza Puff, but I'll try. I can't talk no more shit. I'm excited though. Excited to try this. Is this worth $300? Let's God, see. this is so yellow. And there's my wing up close, looks like a highlighter. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah, keep disgusting me. I don't, I'm not getting a lot of flavor. I got a, up front some Mountain Dew flavor, which honestly isn't too bad. Right. But because I know it's Mountain Dew flavor, uh -huh. it weirds me out. That, oh man. Because that's not something I want mixed with. And you know what it is? It's just the citrus flavor I'm getting. It's very citrusy, but like. But because I know it's Mountain Dew, I'm going, oh, that's Mountain Dew flavor. And then I'm going, why do I want Mountain Dew 
on my chicken wings you don't. and then I'm going, I don't. You don't. If you're someone who found this video and this is your first time watching us, hello. If you paid a lot of money for that, I'm very sorry. I hope you flipped it like a house and made bank. Yeah, I think if you're buying this, it's if you're spending $300 on this, yeah. it's not to eat. It's like it's it's like getting a, a Michael Jordan uh, trading card. Like a rookie card. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. It's a collector's item. It is spicy as hell though. Does that thing live on your balcony? Hey, troll, get back down to your little cage. Holy damn, it's approaching my place. Last up, the sweet, the spicy, the smoky, chimney rock hot sauce. Made with smoked habaneros. This is from Auburn, Alabama. Habanero peppers, water, honey, vinegar, mango juice. All right, here we go, chimney sauce. Chimney sauce, cheers. cheers. Oh, that's shiny. It like tastes shiny. <laughs> <laughs> Mm -hmm. I'm getting that smoky taste, which I'm not a huge smoky guy. Yeah. But it's not overpowering smoky, so it's still, I'm still enjoying it. I like this. You can really taste the fruit coming through. Mm. Mm -hmm. I'm getting that good mango. That's not bad at all. No, that's pretty good. I like that. I do. Well, I guess it's official. Okay. Chimney, so this just reminds me of Dick Van Dyke. Chim chimney, chim chimney, chim chim chiru. Chim chimney, chim chimney, chim chim chiru. Good luck, we're above when I shake hands with you. One of the all-time great performers. He really is. They don't make him like Dick Van Dyke anymore. And that's lucky too. Wow, and a good heat on that. I can't tell if it's the build of all three, but I feel like I really enjoyed that. Yeah, I think that's got that's got the most heat, I think, because it's still kicking me. Also, shout out to snagging the URL chimneysauce.com. The only other thing that could be snagged for is some weird porn. It'd be a weird porn. Like, let me let me dip into your chimney sauce. It would be a Santa thing. It would be a holiday porn category. I was thinking it would be like, let me in your chimney, and then the sauce would be while you film. Yeah, yeah, for sure. That's why I figured like Santa comes down the chimney and he delivers you the chimney sauce. Do mm. so you guys stop watching yet? Let me know if you're there because it feels like my pants are down. And if they are, I'm gonna quit struggling because I'm almost certain when I do, you can see my pee. Before we go ahead and pick our favorite sauce here today, on this random, my mouth is spicy, dude. Yeah, it's hot. Let's do a shout out. Merch out, merch out, merch out. Number six for cheese.com is the website. Buy something off the website, get a shout out. If you buy more than one thing, get a shout out faster. If you sign up for our hot sauce subscription, dude, we got three different ones now. We got the mild, you can sign up for it, get the subscription. You can do the hot, get the subscription, save 25%. Now you can also get both every month for $18. That's saving six bucks off as if you would have gotten the two. Today, two names. Merch out of number one goes Mr. Trevor Moore. <laughs> We sent Trevor two bottles of our famous Sixer sauce. Uh, we sent those out to Pennsylvania where he resides. I hope you're enjoying those. Uh, probably already smashed, demolished, yeah. and hopefully re-upped. Yeah. Merch shout out number two, Mr. Robert B. Wood Jr. Woohoo! Also two bottles of Sixer sauce. Egan or Egan? I think Egan. Minnesota, Minnesota nice. Uh, thank you so much for buying that. We'll see you very soon. Uh, getting that higher Sixer sauce, I'm sure, because it's sweeping the nation due to a poll I made up. Number six with cheese.com, you dudes. Snag it. All kinds of sexy B-roll of sauce being made. You need it. All right, at the end of these episodes, we like to go ahead and uh, tell Eric McCluskey to please start playing the pans. Thank you, sir. And we're gonna pick our favorite sauce here today. And just maybe, we'll play rock, paper, scissors to see who gets to keep their favorite. <gasps> Ready? Yeah. One, two, three. I thought so. Yay! Yay! Yeah, I thought this was chimney rock, dude. That was pretty good. Yeah. And I thought this was pretty good. It was good. It was uh is not I it looks like it's gonna hit me with more flavor. I don't want to get into it. it but does. it's beautiful looking. The biggest takeaway from today is that this lost to these two. Yeah. I feel like with the hype you're given this and you have a big brand like Mountain Dew, I feel like that should have, you know, a couple of hot sauce enthusiasts, I, I feel like it should have made us happy. That was just kind of whatever on it. <laughs> Let us know if you guys have had any of these sauces before and what you think of it. Did you buy into this Mountain Dew craze? Are you one of the people that got it? Let us know. And uh, we're back here tomorrow for a brand new video, Tuesday through Friday. Sure! I'll have a drink of the two brothers. Man, we're not ready. I'm a lightweight dude. Paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Ah! <laughs> it's all right, you want the other one anyways. I want to get chimney rocked. Yeah, that's true.
Think I can sell this one for 150? Yeah, it's cracked, we'll be honest. It was in a video though.